this right now, right? So every year, approximately 18,000 people in the U.S. ages 0 to 74 are diagnosed with a life threatening illness where a bone marrow transplant is needed, according to the World Marrow Association. So given the current makeup of the Be the Match registry, the likelihood of finding a match for a patient in need of a transplant is 29 to 79 percent. The addition of more donors to diversify the registry is critically important. It is a big deal. So right now I am joined by Dr. Mohamed Hijazi with the Brown Cancer Center. So first, of course, I would like for you to walk me through just the kind of patients that need a bone marrow transplant. So uh, patients who need a bone marrow transplant are typically patients of leukemias of different types, lymphomas, mm -hmm. myelomas, and sometimes what we call benign hematologies. And there's a few solid cancers that are still needing uh, bone marrow transplant such as testicular cancer. Mm -hmm. So as the sister of a childhood cancer survivor, I got registered for Be The Match at a pretty young age. I think it is critically important. And I know mm -hmm. that uh, just by nature of my relation to so many childhood cancer patients, it seems like there's a lot of kids who have one of those life-saving transplants. So how many of those transplants are you all actually doing at the Brown Cancer Center? So at the Brown Cancer Center, we have been growing tremendously over the past number of years. Historically, we've been doing between 30 to 50 transplants, but last year we had a record number of 94 transplants, almost 100. In a single year? In one year, last wow. year, 2022. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow, that's really impressive. Um, now, I think that there is a couple of misconceptions about what it means to be a, a donor and what mm -hmm. that process is like. So if you want to be a donor, how do you get registered? And then uh -huh. if you end up being a match for someone, what happens? Wonderful. So I'll actually tell you my personal experience. Sure. When I became a match, yeah. when I became a, a, a registered donor, mm -hmm. uh, all what you do is you go on bethematch.com, mm -hmm. you put in your information, they will send you a kit. The oh. kit will have a Q-tip, you just uh, swap it on the inside of your cheek on mm -hmm. each side. Mm -hmm. It will come with a prepackaged labels where you drop it back in it and send it back to the organization of Be The Match. Mm -hmm. And you will enter the registry and they will have your information, like the DNA information that mm -hmm. shows if you link to another patient who needs a transplant in the future. Right, and it's pretty easy. They just take it right out of your arm, right? Yep. You don't have to do the full spinal tap or anything no. like that. It doesn't really knock you out like it used to. Yes, we have changed a lot over the years. Mm -hmm. Back in the day, 20, 30 years ago, that was the only ways to go into the bone marrow and mm -hmm. harvest a liter out. Right. That is like maybe less than 1% of the time that we do them. We did more than 100 collections last year, mm -hmm. and we only did two actual marrow collections. All right. 98 were through. You get a little shot that multiplies the patient's, the person's own, they are not patients, they're mm -hmm. healthy donors. Sure. Um, the, the patient's own stem cells multiply. Uh -huh. Some of them leave the bone marrow into the bloodstream, and it's just like a blood donation. Mm -hmm. the, the blood goes through the machine, stem cells out, the rest of it comes right back. Right. And the, pa the donor does not lose anything at all. Right. So a really easy process. Very simple process. Perfect. Well, yep. thank you so much for being here You're with us today. Welcome. We appreciate your time. Now, GMA is partnering with Be The Match for One Match Second Chance. It's an initiative that's being pushed by Good Morning America as the show celebrates 10 years since Robin Roberts returned to the desk after receiving a life-saving bone marrow transplant. You can hear more about her journey this morning right after GMK.